know I love this sport. And I love being here in the thick of it. I love the smell of oil and burnt rubber. And that's why I want to be down on the track next time you're sitting in one of my cars. So, I've got two events on the table right now that'd be perfect. But which is more interesting to you? That's the question. From my point of view, there's really no difference to speak of. So it's entirely your call. Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nog. Welcome along to the Invitational event, the second one of the season. Um, doing these as separate videos just to keep them separate. And I decided that I wanted to drive the 1998 McLaren, uh, which uh, won the world title with Mika Hakkinen. So um, yeah, it's a checkpoint challenge around Brazil. Uh, not driven around Brazil on the new game yet, so um, it will be pretty interesting. We need to do uh, 7.5 kilometers in order to pass this one. So, um, yeah, without further ado, let's uh, head on over to the onboard camera and uh, see how we go. So there we go guys, didn't quite manage to make the objective this time around, but nonetheless it was a pretty fun car to drive, it felt pretty planted onto the road, and um, yeah, for having no previous experience around Brazil on F1 2017, um, I think I did pretty well. I think I was probably in too low a gear at a couple of corners, but um, as we head down to the end of the first sector here, out wide, and then swing in to hit the apex, um, went off the track a little bit, so lost a bit of time there. But um, yeah, these checkpoint challenges are pretty, I think they're going to be pretty hard. Um, you kind of gain time for each checkpoint gate that you hit, but um, you don't get enough time to actually, you know, it keeps decreasing, is what I meant to say, sorry. You keep, the time keeps decreasing uh, each gate that you get, so um, yeah, you've really got to be nice and tidy and try and hit the apexes and keep on the racing line as we, uh, how do we do this hairpin? Uh, the exit's a bit sloppy. Although we didn't go out to the curb, so it wasn't that bad. It wasn't too bad at all. But, um, yeah, no, had great fun with this. Um, it's nice to drive these classic cars because the, the modern F1 cars, they um, they spin up a lot and it's very easy to like make them slide around and, and spin around all over the place. So, to get the brake and actually have um, something that's planted is nice and fun to drive. You feel like you can throw it around in the corners. Although, it does throw you a bit because the next time you then get in the 2017 car, you kind of think you can do the same thing, which clearly you can't. 
and then nine times out of ten you mess it up and end up in the barrier. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to keep the like I'm going to keep the invitational events um, separate from the main sort of career videos. Um, I will just still put them in the career playlist though, just so you guys can see them. But um, yeah. Hope you enjoyed it, guys. As always, like, comment, subscribe down below. If you've got any tips that could, uh, you know, potentially help my driving style, I still feel like I'm being a bit tentative in corners and could still probably get better exit speeds and things. So if you've got any tips, uh, whether it be about driving style or being like more aggressive on starts, I don't think I'm a bit, you know, tentative on starts. So, you know, any advice on how to be more aggressive to try and gain more place at starts would be grateful. But uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. And as always, guys, I've been Nock. You've been awesome. Happy gaming.